In this lesson, I will explain to you how you can insert comment in Microsoft Excel as well as we will also discuss mini toolbar and shortcut menu. Right, so here is the small data. If you have thousand row, rows, you can use the same concept. This is the sales column and if you want to see the highest sale, so I think this Taj has the highest sale. He has purchased the things uh, of amount $9,999. If you want to insert some comment here, so what you have to do, select the cell, right click. When you will right click, you will see this part and this part. So this is small part is called the mini toolbar. And this one is called the shortcut menu. In shortcut menu, you can see insert comment. So click here. So this box will open. So here we can write down that this is the highest sales. Right. One more time. If you want to write down another comment. So we can see the lowest sale. I think this is the lowest sale. Instead of writing the comment anywhere on this cell, suppose if you want to write down same thing, right click and then insert, right insert comment. Here we will write down lowest sales. See how simple it is to enter the comment. If you want to delete this comment, so what you have to do, select the cell, right click in shortcut menu, you can see delete comment. So when you will click here, it's gone. Come to this comment, right? So right click. This time, if you want to edit your comment, so this one is the edit function. Click here. So highest sale, good job. Good job, Taj. Right? If anyone wants to see your file, whenever he or she will see this red triangle at the end so it means the comment is there so how to see the comment just bring your insertion point here do not click just bring it he or she can read or even you can read highest sales good job so you know how to add comment or insert comment how to delete comment and how to edit comment right now is for the mini toolbar suppose now i am selecting a row right and then right click so this is called the mini toolbar here you can use different functions open this see these functions are also available in home tab but here this is called the mini toolbar important functions are here open this if you want right to make this yellow okay yellow same if you want to increase the font size from here, font, bold, italic, right, center, whatever. So this is the called the mini toolbar. Now suppose if you will select, right, one word. On the top of that word, you can see there is, I will show you one more time, right. This is, this is the mini toolbar. It has less, mini, mini toolbar. It has less function compared to mini toolbar. Right? Only we have font size, font, bold, italic, color, and that's it. So when you will get this mini toolbar, when you will select it, see like this. But if you will select, suppose a column or row, whatever, right click. So here you can see we have shortcut menu as well as we have mini toolbar. Now suppose if you want to cut this column from here and paste, suppose we are going to paste here. So I will show you what is the difference between cut and paste. See, in clipboard group, we can have cut, copy, paste, but right click in shortcut menu, we can also have cut, copy, and paste. So here I'm going to cut and here right click and paste. So see here, cut means it will cut from the original position and wherever you want to paste. Now, same thing, if I want to copy, okay, I will copy this time too. So you should know or maybe the complete table. Right this one here you can click copy but we are learning from the shortcut menu copy and where you want to paste right click and just click here. So now what is the meaning of this number number it means our numbers are long enough cannot fit in the width of the cells. So see how simple it is. Copy means we can have another table, or even one row you want to copy, or one column, or whatever, or the table. Cut means it will cut, 
and it will paste to the new position. Copy means just like a photocopy. Right now, if you want to add a new sheet, and first easiest way is just click on this plus sign. Right, then we can have, but another, another way is right click where you want to enter, and then this one. The first is the insert, and see this menu will open. Click on the worksheet, this worksheet, and see we can have a new worksheet, sheet number three. Right, right click, insert. But the simplest way is just click on this plus sign. So I hope how to enter the command mini toolbar shortcut menu is clear to you. Please practice it. See you in the next lesson and thank you. But please do not forget to subscribe to my channel, Saima Data Science.